Oh, this guy's a dick. That is the worst pun I've ever heard <laughs> in my life. That's the way to go, though. Thirsty Thursdays, this this R2K. the R2K, plus our very first guest. This is something special. Peter Daly's here with us. Yeah. We just actually recorded a bunch of stuff here too, so it went really well. And we're going to maybe put some samples. We can maybe do that. So before, the thing, before anything, before we get going here, let's pour a drink. Is that why we call it Thirsty Thursday? I think we can. Do you want the guest? The, the guest can Absolutely. There's still sure. beer all over the floor, though, man. Yeah, so we'll... Uh, this well, is homebrew, am I correct? Yes, yes, and this is the one all that... All right, uh, so I'm not sure how much I trust your homebrew, so I'm going to take <laughs> this much homebrew. Let's we'll do a little bit each. And how strong is it? It's, it's kind of strong. It's heroin in, a, heroin in the pitcher, isn't it? It smells like fruit. What'd you make it out of apples? I, I don't... It's surprisingly well. I drink it, I don't make it. Good. Cheers. There you go. So cheers to a thirsty Thursday with our cheers first guest. Here. I think it's really easy. There you go. And this is kind of, it's not very cold, but it's like ice cold. You guys should get an alcohol license it's good. and sell this. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. Okay, so we just recorded. Um, you um, guys are going to try and collab. Let's go with that first. Oh, that, is that the one on my EP or your EP? Can't Probably be. yours. I don't know what it all depends on. Yeah, oh. what the way the cards full. But okay, uh, so I have one of mine called Emotionless. I want this guy on, and it's about just being a fucking bummed out shit. No, <laughs> seriously, it's about it's about life getting you down into some hard situations, struggling, trying to get out. You still gotta, still gotta put up that front, put up that grind every single day, and not not let that get you down. Maybe you gain a few pounds doing it. I got I got some questions. for I'm dying to know. I've known you for a while now, but I've never really known. Ooh, questions? How did you get started with Battle Axe? Like, who was the person that got you involved with Alright, so, uh, Gordon posted a video a few years ago called Cage Up. Uh, yes. Uh, we had produced it together. Um, he wrote it. He, he picked the beat. I, I did all the production quality stuff. I did the recordings. The quality was okay. Uh, we dropped it. It was just a free track. Yep. And... I got a, got a couple thousand views. I don't nothing to really write home about. And then eventually, he got a. I got called to do some corporate thing, right? Rap show. It was weird. It was cool. Paid well. And then Gordon got a call from the Battle Axe guys or a message on Facebook from Brad. Actually, I think it was because well, yeah, from Unity, right? Yeah, for hip hop in the six, they're bringing here. They want local rappers, and then they asked us if we wanted to join Battle Axe. They were so hip hop in the six was the first thing with them. With them, yeah. Oh, yeah. In Saskatchewan with Gordon. That was oh. Gordon's first show ever. Oh, really? Oh, I didn't know that. That wasn't that long ago. Yeah, that was... Shit, he's come a long way. Oh, my buddy. I am, <laughs> I am proud of that kid. Yeah, that's right. Well, he is yeah. about... That was over a year ago. That wasn't this that long ago, ago, yeah. So what got you into the rap thing in the first place? I don't know, buddy. When, when did you set the guitar down and decide to rap a bit? This is way back in the East Coast, day. Eh? So... Ironically, I was into punk music and emo music mm. when I was 14. Prior to that, honestly, never really listened to music mm. at all. Maybe when my mom played in the car when I was in the car, but I would just watch cartoons and fuck if I know what I did. I was a fat kid. I ate food. Became a teenager and was like, music. Music, yeah. Mm. And I started with Green Day. I fucking mm. loved it. My I did start with Green Day too. Come up there. there. Yeah. yeah. Warning yeah. album was probably the first one. Billy Talent came along, man. Holy shit, what is this? That you know, I met them one time. Man. Who, was, Billy Talent? Yeah, you know, I was DJing at the Radisson in Saskatoon during the, the Junos was in Saskatoon. And I, <laughs> I went outside to have a cigarette before the thing I was doing in the reception hall. And, and these guys are hanging out front and I bummed the light off on them. I had a cigarette with these guys, not knowing who I was having a cigarette with. And then, like, a fucking limo came up and they got in and they drove away and I'm like, Wait a minute, that guitarist in that tall hair, that's pretty yeah, sweet that's signature, and I just thought about for a second, I'm like, being the burnout in the store that I was at the time, I was like, dude, I just like had a cigarette and talk about the weather with Billy Talent, I have no idea, 
I like did that, but yeah, that's sweet. Yeah, they had some good tunes. They actually continue to make some. Yeah, good they're still on the radio still, today. They're still yeah. around. Yeah. Absolutely. Lots of new bands are still around. Uh, sorry, lots of those bands you used to listen to back in the day are back. And we saw Forty One has just dropped now. Blink Linkin Park is Blink One Eighty Two. Yeah. Fucking who else is back out there right now? Uh, my Chemical Romance. That's a little bit newer, or no? They are, they own. broke up a few years oh, ago they after their Danger Days yeah. album. Well, we're, we're losing track here. I just want to know where yeah, the guys started rapping. rapping. That's what I wanted to know. And let yeah. everyone know where no, the whole yeah, town is. Where is the home? My home hometown is Picton, Nova Scotia. If you've never heard of it, it's where you take the ferry to get to PEI. That's the best way I can think to describe it. It is no bigger than Unity or Cut Night. Oh, it's definitely fucking bigger than Cut Night. <laughs> <laughs> we were in this tiny ass town that was like two streets, people. It's. <laughs> It's mental. I don't know how these guys do it, but uh, Unity's not much better. But yeah, Picto is. At least you got the ocean right there. Yeah, you got the yeah. ocean view. Deal with that, huh? Also, land of the living sky, bro. Land of the living fish in the fucking water, bro. <laughs> <laughs> are you it's feeling nice guys too? Are you feeling homesick though? Let's segue into that. Oh, uh, this guy's a dick. That is the worst pun I've ever heard <laughs> in my life. That's the way to go, though. Don't die. Go it's die a, now. It works. That's the same it's right way. Up. He's talking about my EP coming up. Home Absolutely. Sick. That's a cheap Yeah, that was. Oh, God. That was disgusting. Oh. That's a cheap plug. Anyways, my album, EP, yeah. yes. Okay, so me and Richard are both doing one. Mine is called Homesick. It was called Finish Line. Then it was called Homesick. I don't know why. Don't ask me that question. Richard is the. No. The, the Maniac EP. The Maniac EP. I keep wanting to say The Adventures of R2K because that sounds funny. That's the main oh, title. We're, we're, getting, we're getting towards uh, maybe a release party. We'll release them both at the same time. So. Yeah, we're looking for a release yeah. party. We had a date in mind, but I'm not sure we could say that in case it fucks yeah, up. It yeah, work. there's always a bump in the road. Yeah. Yeah. You never know. So Brad kind of reached out to you, got you into Battle Axe. I really reached out to Gordon. Reached out to Gordon. And then Gordon, and Gordon was Gordon. I, I wasn't worried about it. I think Gordon was struggling to get in with his set ready in time. Not really. I think he could have pulled it off. He would have last minute, but he came to me. Right? Maybe and, I came to him and I'm like, do you want some help? He's like, yeah, that'd be cool. So we went to the shed and then we did it. And then Brad was talking to me and he's like, oh, you're Gordon's buddy. Yeah, Gordon said you rap too. I'm like, yeah. And he's like, you want to go rap our show? So you done shows prior to that. A few back home. Uh, yeah, I used to, we used to do some stuff. Like I said, it's, it's a lot different down well, here. How, how old were you when you moved here? Only one. Twenty one when you moved out here. What brought you out here? Co op did. Oh, oh fuck. That's good. Well you got we all gotta make a living. <clears throat> so we have uh, I, I guess a new segment is pretty much what it is, is Peter is here and he's the first guest, he's the first MC to actually rap in this. He called me an MC like I'm community. a real MC. Oh god, <laughs> dear lord, thank you. Like the, you know what? Nice yeah. to be here, guys. I appreciate it. So, we have a new room. We have a new thing here. We're going to have this studio door that can actually, when it's fully done, it can be replaced. And so, what we're going to do is have Peter sign. Yep, turn it yeah, you can turn. Oh, and I was going to draw a dick on it, but now that I'm going to sign it, so I'm going to do that instead. I guess that's probably it. Let's dick move to do. There's my plan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. man, this I have terrible handwriting. <laughs> I have the worst handwriting in the world. I'm gonna just this is the first. Like if you guys can yeah. see it, and so any MC that wants to come in and record, you get the privilege of signing this door. But the only way that you can sign this door is to step in the booth and actually record something. You can't yeah. just come and hang out. Oh, hey, that's good. No, you need to be in the booth and record something. That's the only way to sign the door. Yeah. And so with that, I'm Peter, really good with the computer. I can make your music sound nice. Peter uh, is a good, <laughs> yeah, Peter can actually edit too. So if you want to get at him, we'll put all his links below as well. Oh God. And that's, uh, <laughs> a, a heart or you know, like cartilage. He's, he's going, he's going full out with the graffiti. Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, so I have some have another 15 minutes. He signs his name. Yes. Yeah. We can plug the rest, I guess. There was another, a while he another beautiful day in the prairies. Don't forget to look out for the new uh, EP from Peter Daly. Yes. Also, subscribe. We can't put his links, like I said before. Yeah, we'll before. put his links so, on there. Yeah, it's Facebook. Uh, um, what, yeah. Instagram, Instagram Twitter, Twitter, or Facebook, or, Facebook, or, in, or YouTube. I'll post my links in the description. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to stay off the grid yeah. at all costs. There you go. So, uh, what else do we want to know about old Peter here? Yeah, you're 
Peter moved here from Nova Scotia. Peter came here when he's 21. If this Peter. video gets more than so many views, there's going to be people in the comments telling you shit about me that I don't oh, want no, you to know. We're going to take all the yes. people that you know back home. Yes, give us all the dirt on yes. Peter. And then we'll do a second interview, yeah. and that'll be way better. Yeah, it'll be, That's going to be, be good. great. Yeah. So with that, I guess we could do it'll the be. chug it while you plug it. We can do that. Chug right it and plug it? Yeah. You want to so do that? You yeah. want to plug? Well, yeah, I'll do it. that for sure. Okay, well, so you, you chug it and plug it. So we're going to chug it while he plugs it. <laughs> and I have X amount of time. So I have so to plug. He has to plug all of our stuff. Social media. Name of your EP, name of my EP, my links, your links. Yes. Your name, we already did it. But I can... is, uh, he's just going to fire it all off. And the goal is to finish your drink before he can somehow rattle it all off. And he there does not have a clue. Fist. What it, I'll ooh. do it without your drink. No, that's yours. No, that gives me a good chance. Fuck you. Yours. Okay. You finished I'm not, I mean, I've got to, I've got to play. you got to chug. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so once again, Battle Axe Global. Thirsty Thursdays. This is, is uh, to all the members out there. And Peter week. joining us. Look at our, our first guest. Us. So, okay, so check out the social media. It's Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. And also, check out Nova Scotia because he's everywhere there. Homesick! Homesick! Homesick. Peace.